Hello everybody. Um my father brought me to this place uh when I was almost like 3 years old and then when I was 9 we came back again and now I'm almost 14 and we're here back in Stewart BC and the surrounding area. It's so magical. I want to come here again and again. I'm addicted to it. even my whole entire family that's been here are addicted to this place so my dad is going to review the rv park and um give you a lot of information on this it was a really good uh, rv park so let's jump into it hello everyone we are here at um Bay River RV Park uh, in Stewart, BC. That is considered very north, uh, but it is not as far as we think. So, we stayed at this campsite twice, like 10 years apart. Like first time I visited this campsite, that well, like uh, RV site, that was uh, July, uh, July 2014, and now it's 2024. Uh, so. it's still the same i i would say it's even better and uh, this is a awesome campground uh, if you are coming from uh, um highway 37 there is only one way in from uh, highway 37 uh, you take 37a as soon as you come close to the town uh, just uh, after the bear river bridge you make a left and then first left uh, that's where um this campground is and it's uh if you want uh to be sure that on the right hand side there is a welcome to stewart sign and uh we stayed here three nights and uh before we stayed there to here two nights it has 68 full hookups and five dry campsites uh the uh the owners are uh, Corey and Natalie and the manager is uh Kyle uh so they they do amazing work and the customer service is amazing so we we just enjoyed our stay it was with the kids uh that's uh and they do have um uh, um uh, showers those are coin showers i believe they work more than 4 minutes and uh, the laundry is amazing i have ne- never used it but i have seen others uh those are uh, those are using it that's pretty much ab- about it guys and uh, i just want to uh, i was not in mode of making this video but uh if we find something wrong then we we are pretty quick to write a review on uh, tripadvisor or something but uh, i got amazing service here so that's why i i just uh, uh wanted to make this video i was not prepared for it that's why i, I am just kind of <laughs> I'm saying random things but these are all good things and if you look at look around here look around this way and uh, this is just a very clean campsite i don't see any mess around anywhere like even it's it's completely clean and uh, um the gravel is laid out pretty well so uh let's go into their office and uh, i can show you their gift shop is amazing and because the gift shop uh is not expensive so if you want some souvenirs it is it is worth getting it from here instead of uh, wandering around in the uh, in the town So I did talk to them. I can I can make a video here. And other thing I want to mention, like it is not a promotional video, uh, from um, the owners or the manager. No one. Uh, it is just uh, because I love Stewart, and uh, it's always good to have a place where you go, especially very remote. It is a remote town, and uh, when you get such a high fi or good service here, uh, it is very impressive. Uh, So look at this gift shop the prices are pretty much same as you would get in town I bought this book about the Stewart history as well so because uh, it is always a uh, fascinating uh for me to come to north and uh, a lot of people ask me what do you find in north it's it's so so remote 
That is the beauty, like you can connect to nature here. All the gifts here, like especially with this uh, tent thing. You turn this on, oh, it is dead almost. So, but it has a light in the in it. And my daughter bought a couple of stuff, uh, things from here. And uh, especially these unique, these are pencil sharpeners. Look at these. It is $5 only and they're metal and they're very antique looking. So I'm not kind of saying like you should get everything from here, but it is, uh, it is worth it. And uh, I'm going to sign this book as well soon. Um, so folks, uh, this is all about it. And I, I will post some videos from this campsite, which my kids recorded while they were biking around. And if you go behind the side, there is the Bear, Bear River is going just behind the side. And uh, it has a long trail. You can go bike along and everything. But be aware, this is a bear country. It is uh, like have a bear spray at least and be vigilant about your surroundings. Uh, <clears throat> so we have seen a bear coming out from behind our campsite and uh, going to the other side. But it was a black small bear. Like if you're coming here, you should not be scared of the bear, but you should be cautious about it. So I have not seen any bears on this campsite so far. Um, I asked about it and they said it was reported a couple of days ago and uh, no human and bear interaction. So, but if, if you're coming to Stewart, probably you know about the bears are around, but this campsite was pretty good from that perspective as well. But I, I believe there is no guarantee and uh, because, uh, Bears are everywhere in North. Uh, so this is uh, pretty much about it, folks. I will post, post some clips at the end. So if you're visiting Stewart and if you have RV or if you, even if you want to dry camp on a full hookup, you will have electricity and water right on the side. So that's a plus. Um, so folks, see you guys uh, in the next video and uh, keep exploring.